the time that I am filming this, it is Easter, happy Easter resurrection day to you. Um, what a day of just amazing hope and joy. And I hope you guys have had an amazing Easter Sunday with your family. I know that even though it was raining here and that we are having to do online services for a while, I just, I felt the presence of the Holy Spirit in my home and I know that he visited you guys too because um, he's just so good that way. And even though we're apart right now, we're still united. So I'm just really excited about that. So happy Easter to you guys. I am taking a small leap of faith and I have felt for the past few days, the Holy Spirit prompt me to start documenting uh, the artworks that I am creating here in my studio. Welcome to my studio. Um, and that he wants me to just kind of share my thought processes and what he's revealing to me and what I'm creating with you guys. It's very vulnerable, but I have been practicing for the past year and a half real authentic intimacy and vulnerability. And this is just the next step because even though you're on the other side of my screen, I still believe it's so important to bear each other's burdens and bear each other's hearts, you know, share, share our truest selves with each other. And this is one of the ways that I'm going to do so. So welcome to my creative corner moment. So this is our first one and I feel like it's a great time because I'm about to start a new piece about the wilderness. And so I was like, ah, Holy Spirit. It's like, you know what you're doing, right? Because I uh, drafted and sketched this imagery he showed me back in like early January. It was January 12th of this year. And I knew that I was embarking and starting a wilderness season but I didn't know that it would exactly look like this. I thought it was going to be a little bit more personal journey, personal wilderness, um, and isolation where he's teaching me things, but not so much literally stuck at home in isolation in a wilderness that we are all collectively experiencing. But he knows all. Lord knows all. And his word can bring continuous revelation and so I feel finally released to actually create this. A lot of the times I hold on to my pieces until Holy Spirit's like, okay, now is the season to actually create it. So this is the image here. And it's just drafted in ink pen in my, my journal. Um, but it's of a young girl and she is picking flowers and cultivating a little garden in the middle of these kind of what I saw as um, briars and briar woods, trees, foresty wilderness. And around her is just so much hope and it's so much light, there's going to be kind of light emanating from within her. And I think that's all where we're all kind of at right now. Each of us in our own way are having to find that light, that internal light. And you know, that is the Holy Spirit. That is our connection with the Spirit of Christ. Especially on such a beautiful day like Easter Day, we were co-crucified and co-raised up with him. And we are blood-bought sons and daughters. 
And when there's so much wilderness going on and so much external stimulus, I know I have felt very overwhelmed lately with the media and social media and people wearing masks and, you know, trying to do what's right for them, but also there's a lot of fear attached and fear will cause panic and panic will cause rash decisions and people being rude to people and it's just a lot. But we have an internal light source that when everything external seems so dark, we have an internal source of light that we can go. We can go into our quiet place, into our prayer closets, our prayer rooms, and touch the spirit of the Father and receive that life-giving light. And it will emanate from inside of us. It will actually cultivate until the wilderness, until the ground in the wilderness, so that the harvest can come, so that flowers and fruit and vines may bloom. It's, it's a toiling season, but there's gonna be so much harvest on the other side of this. So I just want to invite you on this little journey with me as I create this piece I'm thinking of putting it on a wood panel this time. Um, and I haven't decided if I want to do acrylic or oil paintings. It's been a long time since I've oil painted because um, being a teacher, I haven't had much time to get out that medium. It's very time consuming, but you know, now that I'm teaching at home, I may be able to take some of these sunny days, open up a window and bring out the oil paints. What do you guys think? Please embark with me on this journey. We are all going through our wilderness seasons. We're all going through a preparation season. And I am just really excited to share the process of creating this piece and sharing the revelation from this piece as it comes about. But, trying to find, find my word. I don't remember exactly where it is. It's in here somewhere. But the Holy Spirit told me once that, oh, here it is. He told me that you are making a place in the wilderness and I have work for the wilderness. Um, and so I believe that's the season that we are in right now. And so I just pray and release the peace of the Holy Spirit over you that as you press in deeper and pursue Christ more and being like Christ more, that there will be such a release of purpose over you for the wilderness and that you will not just see briars and thistles and thorns, but you will actually see a place where the Lord is wanting to cultivate something inside of you and cultivate something through you. I release that in the name of Jesus right now. I release creativity over you. I would love for you guys to create your own pieces, um, to get in touch with the Holy Spirit, write, paint, draw, dance, write a program. Whatever it is that you do, just ask the Holy Spirit to do it with you. I would love to see what comes out of it as well. So this is Creative Corner, episode number one. We are embarking on this journey in this wilderness together. But I love you all. Praying peace over you in the name of Jesus. And I will see you next time where I will start the drafting process of this piece. Be blessed. Bye.